Hi, I'm Corey, an artist and instructor from the Bainbridge Museum of Art, here with another Art in Action. We're here in my studio today talking about ways to find inspiration. I find inspiration going outside and finding things just around my house, uh, around my neighborhood, maybe a dumpster close by, maybe a dirt pile over here. I find that getting out and visiting with others gives me inspiration to bring back to the studio to paint masterpieces. I try to find inspiration from day-to-day -day things that I'm doing with my family, such as watching movies, listening to music. One of my favorite spirit animals is the dragon, something I found on a piece of cardboard just headed towards the trash, so I ripped it up and decided to put it in the background of one of my paintings. You can find colored paper pretty much anywhere, in a magazine, in a piece of cardboard. Maybe you have an old book or something that you're no longer using and you want to use that. Here's another piece where I've used found objects such as uh, some local Seattle maps, my favorite candy Pez of course, an old photograph that I found from Life magazine that has always been a big inspiration in my work. I find that by taking found objects and throwing some paint over it really gives it a vibe that is uplifting, colorful, and vibrant. Whenever I'm starting a piece in my studio, I always try to start with good intentions. I take a blank canvas and I try to get a little therapy for myself, just feeling the colors and making texture and just doing what feels right. Not thinking too much of it, but just letting it flow, but really using that time to just feel good, positive thoughts. So I try to put that into all of my paintings when I start. After that, I usually choose a meaning image to myself of a place that has inspired me, such as uh, a Seattle map. In this piece, I use the word smile. I hope that this painting makes not only viewers, but I know it made myself smile. Every time that I look at it, the colors help me to remind myself how I felt when I made that painting and hoping that I can make someone else smile through art. One of the great ways to find inspiration for me is working with others in the studio. And for me, it happens to be my children. I love to incorporate things that they like to create. So I always ask them, hey, why don't you create something and bring it on in the studio so we can use that as inspiration. And for instance, on this piece, I had my kids grab some of their coloring books and we grabbed some stickers and we placed the stickers and they just happen to be very fitting and they make you want to smile to think that superheroes do wear dresses. That just makes my soul come alive. My kids come alive and they smile. So this has been a great inspiration in the studio for me. I like to put that kind of stuff up because you never know what one painting can inspire another painting. Well, thanks for watching. Feel free to share anything inspired from this video. And until next time, it's art in action. Thank you.